I first became involved in nutrition as a psychiatrist observing a 10-year-old boy who had bipolar disorder, a very serious form of it. He was having major temper tantrums for an hour, two hours, four hours a day, every day for some months. Very seriously disruptive set of symptoms. And he took a vitamin mineral supplement and within five days his symptoms cleared entirely. The tantrums were gone on the fifth day of treatment and he wasn't even irritable, he wasn't even grouchy. Now we don't have any psychiatric drugs that can do that. I've never seen a psychiatric drug do that in any case. So based on that one child I began to pay attention to nutrition and to the use of vitamins and minerals in particular to treat mood disorders. Many of the vitamins and minerals that people obtain from drugstores are relatively low quality vitamins and minerals. They contain many ingredients, but they don't necessarily absorb into the body. Their biological availability is often very poor. So it is, in fact, true that often people are taking vitamins and minerals without getting substantial effects out of them, especially in psychiatry when we're using these as medical treatments we look for very much higher quality uh, vitamins and minerals that are demonstrated to have much higher absorption rates than the routine commercial formulations. So in comparing the early data that we currently are looking at on what these broad spectrum vitamin and mineral treatments can do in mental health. What we're finding is that they can have effects that are virtually as strong or as strong as what conventional psychiatric medications can do with much fewer side effects. The surprise, what we were not expecting is that again based on this early data what we're finding is that the stability that the vitamins and minerals are able to achieve is far greater than what the psychiatric drugs will do. So what the patients describe, having been on psychiatric medications and then stopping and moving to vitamin mineral treatments, is that they feel much more clear-headed. The mental fog that they had gotten used to while taking psychiatric medications appears to be much diminished. And patients describe themselves as more clear-headed, able to think more sharply, and more clearly than they had while they were on psychiatric medications. And then after they're off the medications and on the nutrients, their symptoms are well controlled and they notice this very clear change in their mental clarity. If it turns out with more effective studies that we can treat depression, bipolar disorder, attention deficit disorder, perhaps other psychiatric disorders, with vitamins and minerals that were as effective as the current psychiatric drugs, but with much fewer side effects and better long-term stability and with less mental fog. If that were to turn out to be true, then we would have a much better set of alternative treatments to be able to offer patients who are currently struggling with these conditions.